Pushing to legalize abortion without any restrictions is anti-woman, anti-child, and anti-family. I am Christian, I am pro-life, and I am proud to stand with my brothers and sisters of different religions and beliefs. that is needed now more than ever is your voice. You are the voice for those who have no voice. We are motivated by a belief in pursuing justice for all, an eagerness to defend the dignity of every human being, no matter how wanted or unwanted. We demand better. We demand a better path. What the Supreme Court is doing here is actually, I think, a pro-democracy move. It is returning this right back to the people and to their elected representatives. Parents should not be able to commit irreversible medical mutilations on their children. the legislature is attacking people of faith and I don't believe that the Supreme Court would allow that to stand. We are the forefront of the battle for life in not just the United States but I think even in the world. The faith community, like anyone else, needs to evolve with the times. They are going to awake a sleeping giant. Now you're, you're targeting their own organizations, their schools, their churches, their, their nonprofits, and going in them and telling them what they can and can't say. Churches are every bit as essential as a grocery store, and it's important that the government not play favorites or pick winners and losers when it comes to who is allowed to open. The state of California thinks they're better parents than the average parent, and anybody who thinks that biology determines gender, that is not allowed. I am calling today, from this moment forward, every single pastor in the state of California to be a watchman on the wall and to stand up for righteousness. We represent the Christians who refuse to bow down as we engage in a steadfast battle, actively opposing and resisting the profoundly detrimental bills that have been previously mentioned. So do not tell me that things can't change. Do not tell me that the situation, even here in the state of California, is hopeless. Never doubt what God can and will do through the persistent obedience of those willing to do the right thing. Today is just the beginning. It is going to be more important than ever for advocates to stand up, to engage, and to make their voices heard all across the state and around the nation.